gifts aren't coming through but they will um so yeah sign oh thank you everybody so sign empty guys can we have white hearts for our empty please justice for empty around these ways please guys justice for the mother Teresa of the cliff yes he was innocent we're innocent i tell you uh yeah love you mt darling the real ones know and that's all that matters okay the real ones know uh anyway guys as i was saying my son was in hospital yesterday at uh blame the click he had an operation on his toe when he come home with his crutches and his foot bandaged up and his hospital wristband and he left it on till this morning for all the sympathy he did he left his wristband on uh, and do you know what? They wouldn't even let me stay with him. I went to the hospital with him because uh, they did it in a private hospital. Oh, here we go. Thank you, Levi. Thank you, darling. I hope you're over there laughing. Ha, ha, ha. Guys, joking aside, I hate them turkey heads. Um, that Honestly, it's the most horrendous gift. Oh, for fuck's sake. It's the most horrendous gift I've ever seen on TikTok. Oh, my. It's a violation. Levi, how many did you fucking send, darling? Let me just go over there and see if they're all laughing, you bitches. Uh, but thank you. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Moni. Who, who got the turkey stuck on the red? Was it Monica? Uh, so, yeah, sending love to my husband who sat in the living room. I'm feeling really sorry for himself. Uh, having me running around after him but yeah yesterday guys i just had the day off to chill out recharge uh and um we're okay today we're okay look guys are you not streaming oh levi are you not darling get on cam to crew and stream the live darling uh miss red my old account's been hacked i'm gutted i sub to you and everything worked so hard for it oh nikki new darling i'm so sorry guys give nikki new a follow Give Nikki New a follow. I followed you back, sweetheart. Um, yeah, so whatever's happened this week, I know uh, that I'm innocent. I know that uh, other people that have been accused of things are innocent. Um, you know, it doesn't matter what anybody else says. Uh, you know, we've kind of like proved ourselves and everything. And for me, uh, I just want to move on. Um, yeah, I just want to move on and just do what I'm here to do, which is the FYP news. Uh, do you know what I mean, guys? Yes. I like I say, I ain't no angel, uh, but neither is anybody else. Do you know what I mean? Yes. Uh, there we go, guys. End of conversation. Back, FYP. Alexa, play Ain't No Stopping Us Now. Thank you, Lexi. Thank you, Gizmo. Here's Ain't No Stopping Us Now by McFadden and Whitehead on Amazon Music. That's it, I'm out of breath. I'm so unhealthy, everybody. Also, as well, guys, we'll get to 200k likes. Thank you, everybody, for the gifts. 200k likes and then we'll get on with the FYP. If you are new to the room, please, thank you, everybody. Please be sure to follow. Yes. Right, we've got a treasure box here. Do you know what, guys? I was, oh, hang on a minute. It was a sugar bliss. Guys, can we uh, MVP Sugar Bliss for the um, treasure box? Also, as well, if you want some sweets, you know, it's coming up to Christmas and whatever else, be sure to give Sugar Bliss a follow because that's where you get sweeties from. Yes. And she kindly offered me uh, a lovely sweets package, but I'm on a diet. I'm on a diet, guys. Yes. I want to get the bikini body ready. That'd be. Uh, Anyway, guys, good morning, Donna. Morning, everybody. Yes, let's get up this popular, guys. We're usually smashing it by now. Absolutely smashing it by now, aren't we? Uh, and to everybody that comes in here daily and supports me and doesn't troll me, morning, my limbs. Thank you, Beverly. Um, big up yourselves. Yes, we love that. We'll have all the support for Miss Red and the Click. Mm -hmm. That writes all the scripts. Um... Thank you, Cam2 Crew. Thank you, Karen. Thank you, Scrumptious of Margot. Do you know the hair's a bit, uh, it needs washing. Then, hello, Clover. Luke. Hello, Luke, darling. Thank you, Karen. Needs washing the outdoors, guys. Needs a little bit of a wash. 
I tell you what, I was just in Alex's live and I was loving it in there. That's why I was late. Oh, Luke, thank you, darling. Don't do it all, though, love. Yes, you're too kind to me and you give me too much. Do you know what I mean? Yes. Rosie, you will get blocked for sending the turkey heads, darling. Don't even try it around here. Ha, ha, ha. Sophie, I know that you guys have come from Camp True Crew. Let me have a look. <laughs> Big up, Linz. Remember when you sent me that the uh, last time and it gave me an heart attack? I was prepared for it this time. Come on, you bitch. Witch. Not me. Thank you, my Linz. MVP Linz. So, yes, the room will be a little bit quiet today because obviously. Oh, um, uh, Luke, piss off. There are uh, dramas going on elsewhere. Hence why I was late. Because I would have stayed and watched, but I've got to entertain you guys and bring you your FYP. Do you know what I mean? Uh, when you're back, Luke. Do you know what? Joking aside, guys, this, you know, like uh, autumn and winter is really busy for him because people take time off, so he has to fill in for people. Thank you, Faith. Thank you, Dakota. And it doesn't help when he gets bronchitis on top of that. All right? So he's not like avoiding coming back is genuinely really really busy thank you Linz thank you staff staff are taking holidays left right and centre leaving a man in the lurch do you know what I mean thank you guys thank you so much right we're, we're getting there Jenna thank you for your subscription I will try not to get cancelled again uh, <laughs> thank you Donna thank you staff number 21 popular big love Sarah Linz thank you my darling <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Yeah, we've got another 100k to go, guys. To go. I shall not, I shall not be moved until the 200k is done. Yes, not around these ways. Um, morning, TJ. Thank you, Scrumptious and Instagram. Um, Luke's missing TikTok. Is honestly is missing it. Morning, Kelly. Thank you. That's all, folks. And Chloe, happy birthday, Brian Nose Birds. Happy birthday, my darling. 50. Oh, you don't look 50. I'll tell you what, if I look you at 50, I'll be fucking buzzing. Look at you, darling. Not a wrinkle on your face. Uh, happy birthday. Where's Jay? Jay's taking some time out, guys, just to chill and. Um, you know, do some home, start with the turkeys, thank you, do some home improvements, you know, just really get into normal life, normality, instead of uh, being a TikTok bum like the rest of us, do you know what I mean? Hey, she'll be back. Uh, no turkeys, thank you TJ, darling, thank you, Steph. MT, you still in here? I want to know if our MT is still in here. Yeah, I watched you live. I watched you live this morning. Um, I literally couldn't stay awake to watch MT last night. We've been at, yeah, you here, darling. Uh, we had Simon at the hospital daft o'clock yesterday morning, and then I was running around, and then I fell asleep about quarter to seven. I literally could not keep my eyes open. But big up, big up MT. I know you're a good guy, and we love you. Yes, we do. We do, darling. Um, oh, is it your baby's birthday? Happy, happy tenth birthday. Uh -uh. Oh, uh, Ali, my darling, and she said it's my 101st birthday today. I thought you said it's my uh, son's temp. See how I read things? I read things wrong. Thank you, Rox. Lucy! Lucy, don't even try it with me, darling. Come in here with your turkey heads. Thank you, Mimi. Thank you, Scrumptious. 30k after 200k, and then we'll get into it. Yes, give me the moments, Lucy. Big love, Jen. Thank you, Chloe. Uh, it's Friday. It only means one thing. What does a Friday mean, guys? What does Friday mean for the Miss Red? You all know. <laughs> Come on, I'm waiting. It does, it does. Chinese food not pounding, darlings, because Simon's foot's bandaged up. Yes, is got a poorly foot. So there'll be no none of that until the foot is healed. Uh, so okay, okay, a week off, guys. <laughs> it's someone said he doesn't need to use his foot. How do you know? How do you know it? Uh, we'll have none of that language around here about cowgirl and uh, reverse cowgirl and things like that. Come on now. <sighs> no. 
I can't believe I read that out because it's fucking listening. You know what I mean? It'll be like, tink. Oh yeah, why ain't I thought of that? Piss off, Simon. Leave it out. Lucy, I love you. Send any more and you'll be blocked, darling. Yes, yes I'll block you all. Lottie, out. Mm -hmm. No, thank you, everybody. Where am I on this popular? Let's have a look. Right, guys, we are popular number 11. We are, so we have, oh, guys, oh, my God. Why are we doing so bad today? I, I'm not cancelled again, am I? So, guys, I'll be happy with number three on the uh, podium, please, because I've had a terrible time joking aside, getting slandered here, there, and everywhere. Yes, terrible time. Um, let's get red. Yeah, let's get me on the top. I deserve it, just not on top of Simon. You know what I mean? Thank you, Rebecca, darling. Thank you, Emma, Adam. Thank you. Alexa, play the BBC News theme. BBC News theme by TV Theme Tune Factory on Amazon Music. Thank you, Rob. Thank you, Ali. Good morning, everybody. It's Friday again. Friday in this house only means one thing. Yes, yeah, some Chinese food. Definitely not pounding uh, today. Yes, uh, no, Carrie, we'll have none of that business, thank you. Uh, today, guys, we will be having, morning, Jackie, we will be having some difficult, uh, triggering FYP news, but nevertheless, there's nothing I can do about it. You have to keep yourself safe. Yes. Thank you, Lottie. Thank you, Rox and Kelly. We do our best to protect people in here. Alexa, off. But I can't be responsible for 3,000 people. So if it gets hard, out, and then come back. First time comment, a long term watch, I actually think you're Thank you, Ashley. Ashley, do I follow you? Because you get a follow back for that. See, when people are nice to me, I'm nice back. I ain't a bitch till you make me one. Yes, big love, Clover. Thank you, Clover, love you. Yeah. Right, let's get on with it. What have we got in the... Uh, thank you, Poppy. Thank you, Kirsty. And then today I jumped in this red live and I never said anything wrong. Oh. I cannot just say, right, guys. Right, okay. So, I am here, right, not to be biased. I'm here to have my truthful opinions, all right? Whether I get on with the person, whether I don't, I will always be honest about how I feel. Whether you believe that or not, that's up to you. I have heard Talia Dean's song release, and I think it's good, do you know what I mean? And yeah, I don't know if you've heard Talia Dean's song release, me and her don't go, do you know what I mean? I still think she's a bitch. But I think that new song's a bop, you know? Do you think it, I don't, I don't think it's crap, I think it's brilliant. I'm sorry, let me try and get it on YouTube. I, I think that song's brilliant, and I think it's gonna do well. I mean, it does that when you've got Brian May in it. Do you know what I mean? But you, you can't take that away from her. That, that. Linz, thank you, darling. Big up my Linz. Guys, whatever you're doing now, stop. Can you MVP Linz in the chat, please? Lottie, stop it. Now, I like the song I do. I think the video is brilliant. Um, right, let me, let me get it up. I think this is going to do well, and I will always give credit where credit's due when it's an artist, I won't sit here and be a bitch. So this is Talia's new song, it's called You Made Your Bed, Talia Dean and Brian May. Are you ready? Listen to this, it's good. Right, just let me skip that bit. Oh, hang on. Oh, that's the official video. I'm not going to play it all, guys. Can I do it to big screen? Let me just fast forward this bit because it's just like an intro to the song. Come on.
Anyway, guys, that's it. No, I like it. I think it's a bop. Yes. Well done, Talia. I'll give you credit where credit's due. Um, I don't care what your opinions are. When it comes to music, I'll always keep it real. If I like something, I like it. If I don't, I don't. But I did like that. Uh, so we'll, we'll give her it, you know. Yes, for that one. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And Lucy's got a new song coming out as well, isn't you, Lucy? Yes. Hopefully Lucy will give us an exclusive and come on and perform it for us. Can't wait for that one as well. We'll support all the artists on TikTok, whether we like them or not. Do you know what I mean? I don't mean Talia's had our beef, but you've got to give an artist credit where credit's due. Thank you, Rox. Thank you, everybody. I'm not doing a poll on a music video and someone's artistic talents. I'm not doing that. No. I'm just saying well done. Yes. Um, do you know what I mean? Uh, <laughs> oh, I've got a slot there. Someone said, is that really Brian May in the box? I don't, uh, I don't know if it's Brian May. I don't mm -hmm. think it is. Uh, Brian May, stop mm -hmm. clout chasing. Thank you very much, Brian May. Um, <laughs> I think it's a troll account, guys. Thank you, Rox. Thank you, everybody. Popular number six, yes. Um, right, let's crack on with the show. Uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No, I ain't letting no fight, fight Brian May in. No. Right. Oh, sorry, I've got your nose. Thank you, Adam. Thank you, Mr. Rogers. Okay, let me get my uh, thingy things around me and then we'll uh, get on with it. Oh my god. So I was in Cam 2's live this morning. I jumped in the box because I do like it in there. It's, oh, it's Talia. <laughs> well, I ain't letting her in the box because she abuses me, but well done on that, Talia. It was good. And I hope, I wish you all the success with that, and I really mean that because it's pretty, I don't care what these lots say. I think it's good. Um, uh, anyway, guys, where where was I? So, um, I was in Cam 2's box this morning, having a laugh with them, and they were Cam 2 in CLA, and she was going off about the decorating. And uh, so basically, she's paid this decorator. Obviously, you've, you, some of you may watch Talia Dean, right? And uh, not Talia Dean. Look, you got me going now. Uh, CLA, you watch CLA. Well, she's paid the decorator 800 quid to do some decorating, but it's messed up with the skirting boards, right? It's not, uh, it's not Brian May. Look, watch, watch, watch. Let me let him in. Uh, Brian May, will you request again, please, Brian May? Brian, <laughs> Brian request again. <laughs> Come on, Brian. It's not Brian May. Uh, <laughs> as if Brian May is going to be requesting my box, you know what I mean? <laughs> Come on now, people. Anyway, can we move on? Uh, <laughs> uh, right, let me just carry on. Can we forget about... Uh, Brian's a legend, but I want to move on. So, CLA, as, um, she's booting off with the decorator because they've messed up the skirting boards. And I've got to be honest with you, I love the colour of the room, love the carpet, but the skirting boards are horrendous. So I do agree with CLA on this one. Uh, the skirting bo boards are crap, but she's so funny when she's moaning. And I'm here for the decorator going round because she's going to tell the decorator off, do you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, so let's watch CLA. Uh, the men about the decorator. I'll, I'll spend my money and I'll get a professional I'll order the skating boards again and then I'll go live and show people how it's supposed to be done professionally I'll see what the guy comes out when he sees the stale what I've just paid for so no one wants to know no more because I've just paid him another 250 quid yesterday as well so no one gives a fuck sweetheart I'm gonna message him and tell him, oh, don't no, just stay away from me. Thank you. And I helped him with TikTok, yeah. But so what? Why am I helping him? What am I getting out of it? What? What are you getting out of it? There you go. Fuck all. 
He can't even throw a little free job in. <laughs> I don't want his work. His work shit. Oh. To be fair, his painting's okay, but them skirting boards were horrendous. Out of here, darling. None of these companies will even do it for me. What's the point in having all these followers, darling? <laughs> <laughs> There's absolute nobody on TikTok though. Oh yeah, Wix, you'll do their kitchen. But do you know who I am, Wix, darling? I'm someone that can destroy your company. <laughs> <laughs> See LA, I'm about taking Wix down. I can't, I, I, I can't. Okay, Mariah Carey, chill your beans. Tell Wix that, darling, because if I start saying Wix is the shittest store ever, I'm going to be in queue, darling. The way it works is CLA, if you're saying Wix is shit, there's going to be more people going just to piss you off. You know. <laughs> Big up B&Q, darling. They packed everything great, B&Q did. I so did friendship pain. Professional, darling. Tell B&Q I need a new kitchen, please. Can you all write into them and say, help this woman? <laughs> you know, I'm famous. I've got millions of followers. Uh, B&Q. Oh, fuck. B&Q, if you are watching, I could do with a new kitchen, seriously. Like, don't give it to CLA because she's got loads more money than me. Do you know what I mean? What's that noise? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, B&Q, I have more people watch me, so, like, it would be... Oh, it's the, uh, it's the, do you know the scrap man? No, it's the scrap man. Yeah, the scrap man. He comes around shouting, any old iron? And Josh went, Mom, why is that man shouting, my name is Brian? <laughs> yeah, that's what Josh said. He thought he was shouting, my name is Brian. But no, it's any old iron. Anyway, moving on. b and if you are watching, I would love a new kitchen. Uh, so please, like, message me. We have, like, many thousands of people watching in the morning. And CLA is a lot richer than me. Uh, so, you know, if you can help me out a little bit with a new kitchen, a new cooker, definitely. Because Dave Durant said this was from Bright House. And I do kind of, like, get where Dave was coming from with it. So, yeah, help me out, please. Let's carry on watching CLA. Any old or I've got six platforms on this, seven platforms. I've got fucking six accounts on TikTok. Accounts with 350, half a million. <laughs> fucking hell, darling. What's the point in having all these? Good morning, Miss Red. Um, <laughs> I've got to be honest, that was me who said the chicken. The turkey, I mean. Uh, Levi's fault. Levi told me to do it. Levi, you're a bad influence. What's the point in having all these followers? You know, for what? So most people, they want you, oh, yes, can you promote for us, darling? You've got all these followers, darling. I've never had fuck all for free. Good morning, Miss Red. He's messed the skirting boards up and I'm angry at the builder. Not, he's not a builder, he's got a cleaning company, the Italian darling. He's totally fucked it up. DG, good morning. DG, if I showed you the skirting boards, and then I've paid him, I've paid him like 800 quid so far. It's fucked, darling. I mean, okay, Sarah, you just did up, you just hit on a valuable point now, right? So, I mean, she does live in London. Guys, let me sort this out because it's proper fucked up. My name is Brian. Right, so. Oh, piss off with them turkeys. Morning, Liverpool, darling. Thank you. So she does live in London, okay? And obviously London is a lot more expensive than here. So, I don't know. Did she get ripped off? 800 quid? I'll show you a picture of the skirting boards in a minute. What do you think, guys? Did CLA... Let me show you the video first of CLA. Oh, 
I'm on a squiff this morning. It's Simon's fault. Having me run around after him all the time. I've had enough. That is bad. Come on now, guys. And he's not even lining that up. That's got a gap. Look at this. The plug looks good, That's is acceptable, yeah? That is bad. Come this on is now. That's acceptable, yeah? It's on the carpet as well. That's acceptable, yeah? Look how he's done it on the top of the wall. Going across, terrible. Yeah, so he owes me money actually because I'm gonna, I want my 250 quid back. Because <laughs> you know what? You basically told me that you can do the job that you clearly can't do. I paid about £350 to get my skirting boards done. The guys told me that he can do the job and he can't do it. He looks fucking horrendous. Terrible, yeah. So all gone tell him I want my money back. The skirting boards are terrible. <laughs> I've had to pay three hundred and fifty pounds, two hundred and fifty pounds to him. How much is that? <laughs> the guy's taking the piss, darling. I'm fuming. <laughs> and the guy's charging me like he's some fucking. <laughs> Look at the yeah. You're not even a decorator. You're a fucking cleaner. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, she had us all out in this morning. Right, guys. Let, I know the hair. Let's do a pointless poll. Happy face, CLA has every right to moan because the skirting boards were shit. Sad face, CLA, you get what you paid for. And uh, scammer got scammed. I love her rants too. Morning, cockapoo, darling. <laughs> I, I think she's got a right to moan because, uh, you know what I mean? But you do get what you pay for. She's, she, I love her when she's like that, though. It's my favourite version of CLA, that. And I can't wait until the decorator goes round. Thank you, everybody, for your heart, Miss, because the, it's going to go off. And I want some, you know, I want some different to talk about. Uh, thank you for the turkey head, but no more, please. Stop. I, I can't stand that turkey head, guys. I'm not being ungrateful. I'm not... Thank you. I'm not being ungrateful, guys. I do appreciate everything you send me, but there are pretty... <sighs> there are prettier gifts than the turkey head, so... And I'm not saying it to get your money, because, like, I want you to send me more. If I could block the gift, I would. Everyone knows I'm not a fan of the turkey head, like CLA. Lucy, come on now, please no more we do have the pretty lights up here if you want to contribute towards that um i would appreciate that a lot more thank you andrea she knows all about a nice gift thank you the sea scooter knows laura knows lucy doesn't know about the nice gifts it's horrendous isn't it right let's do a pointless poll who thinks that that gift is the most horrendous gift on tiktok's ever done happy face yes sad face no I'm not even saying thank you for, um, right, why ain't it working? I'm not, thank you for the wristbands and the lights. <clears throat> yeah, I'm not thanking for the turkey gifts. <clears throat> thank you, Walt's God, darling. Thank you, Beauty Nanch, thank you. It's a worst gift on TikTok, isn't it? Do you think it's funny? <laughs> Thank you, Laura. Thank you, Carl. Uh, <laughs> see you later in the decorating. Right. Before we get on to the nitty gritty of what's happened, big love everybody, what's happened over the last, see, that turkey gift's cute. What's happened over the last 24 hours on TikTok? The whole EQ, Tory, and AR, um, stink. Uh, we'll get, you know, we'll talk about a few more things before we get into into that stuff. Because uh, obviously we will be talking about it and I will be opening the boxes to have your opinion on the situation. Okay. So, I'm going to show 
um, a few videos of the Alf Bar one, guys. So I know we do have some people in here that don't like playing Alf Bar videos, but nevertheless, Alf Bar is. Thank you, Abby. Thank you, Lottie. Alf Bar is uh, FYP gold for me. Uh, so let's hear what the Alf Bar one's got to say. Yes. Wicked tell Alpha Bar they do not want to be associated with her and she is not happy at all. Um. A response from... And this is on Spicy Noodle Girl. Thank you, guys. My favourite show. Thank you. Piss off. Why is the static so bad on that? You can't hear anything, can you guys? And do you know what? That video has got 27.9k likes on that video. Lou. Don't come in here winding me up, darling. Thank you, guys. It sounds like a kettle, doesn't it? So basically, um, Wicked have told Alpha Bar they want no association with that, but I want to see receipts of this. I want to see receipts of Wicked saying that, but look, you lot are going to hate me now. You're going to absolutely hate me, but I do feel low-key sorry for her. Do you know what I mean? Because it's like a dream dashed in it. I mean, my personal opinion is the uh, her, her whole, sorry, her whole uh, reason for, you know, um, she just believes in her head that she's going to get this part in the play, basically. You know, she thinks that, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll put respect pronouns. She's in her head. She's had this thing that she's going to get this part in the play. Um, and obviously, it's never going to happen. I mean, she isn't the best. She can sing, but she isn't the best singer in the world. I mean, you hear them. Thank you, guys. You hear them people singing the musicals. And they've got amazing voices, you know. Yeah, I think there's a little bit of delusion going on there. But nevertheless, I do feel a little bit sorry for her. Because it isn't nice to have a dream dash. Do you know what I mean? But hopefully, because the show has said that they don't want to be associated with that. You know, she'll get it in her heads. And it'll sink in. As sad as it is. Um, and she'll be able to move on. Do you know what I mean? Because there is a 100% an obsession there, I think an unhealthy obsession and yeah do you not think they'll start? who don't think Alpha Bar will start since the show said that happy face you don't think Alpha Bar will start sad face you do I'd like to think so because she's wasting her life on a dream that's never going to be fulfilled you know but it's digital footprint in it unfortunately I know she's made all these mistakes and you know and she's made them so young but it's digital footprint and it's something that can't be erased you know torian you will get blocked no turkey head thank you darling send a light love send a light Tor torian was speaking about you thank you genevieve thank you yeah see I do feel sorry for Alpha Bar a little bit. I'm going to keep it real. I'm not just going to be a bitch all the time, you know. If I feel sorry for somebody, I can't help being, um, uh, you know, a little having a little bit of empathy. Uh, it's like I can relate, you know. Uh, there was a time at one point when I really genuinely thought I'd bag Brad Pitt. Do you know what I mean? I genuinely believe this. In my head, I thought I'm going to bump into him one day and we're going to get together. And then he met Angelina Jolie, and I knew that it was never going to happen, but it's the truth, Amy. So I know how Alpha Bar's feeling. Yes. Anyway. 
let's watch this one. Thank you, Flamingo Lady and Just Shell. Thank you. Married men have told Alpha Bar that she's hotter than their wives, allegedly. Ooh. Ooh. I've had husbands message me before. I'm not kidding. Like, Thank you, Coco, sweetheart. I was like, what the f? Like, she was like, yeah, she was like, oh, no, you haven't, Hagrid. <laughs> I've had husbands message me before. I'm not kidding. It's like your heart. Right, so I ain't taking a piss in Alf Bar out of Alf Bar in any way, right? So don't think I'm being a bitch. But imagine, right, your husband, it, it'd be like Simon leaving me for Alpha Bar. Thank you for the light, sweetheart. Thank you, Joe. Can you imagine? Your husband leaving you for half bar, like that, how would affect you for the rest of your life? You'd have like uh, serious, your confidence would go for the rest of your life, wouldn't it? Imagine, like, you know what I mean? I get a note one day of Simon, done now it's over. I've uh, been having an affair. Thank you. Uh, I've left you for half bar. And the thing is, this shit could happen. Do you know what I mean? I mean, I know Simon's not going to go off with Alpha Bar, but you don't know, do you? Do you know what I mean? But God forbid, I'd hate to be the wife of the husband that's going to leave. Thank you for the gifts. You know what I'm saying? Uh, who said that? Foxy Baby, how are you even married? I said Foxy Baby, I just approved that. How are you even married? What do you mean, Foxy Baby? Do you not think I'm worth, worthy of a husband? Foxy, ment it, mental health does matter, it does, darling. Uh, Kathy said he can have mine, she can have mine. <laughs> yeah, Foxy Baby, are you married? Do you want a wife? Because I can give you Alpha Bar's number, darling. It won't be a problem. Yes, I can pass an Alpha Bar's number to you. Susie's always doing you dirty. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> thank you, everybody. Yeah, don't come in here trying to put me down. I've got, you know, a, a community in here that I love, yeah. Yes. Anyway, let's move on. Where are we going next? I don't even want to play this one. I'm not playing it. I'm taking it out. That can go. Thank you very much. Let me get some water, everyone. I seen some people in another live saying, ah, oh, Miss Red drives me mad when she drinks out of the water bottle. Stay affected, it's what I do. And my mouth's dry because of medication. Thank you, Jackie. Thank you, K9, and for your subs. Thank you, everybody. Yes, yeah, stay affected. Oh, who sent who sent that? Oh. Thank you. Cheap water bottles though. This is Morrison's. Morrison's is cheap. Leave my water bottle. I can't even fucking drink a water bottle without getting fucking bullied, can I? Do you know what I mean? Just my very existence annoys people. <laughs> Stay affected. Don't care. Oh my God, these turkey gifts. It's not even showing me you sending them, but thank you. <laughs> Guys, we are, uh, we're number four. We're only, we're only 13K away from DG. So that's tats, wristbands, heart We've got nearly 5,000 people in. Get your heart is it, guys. Oh, is it delayed from Luke, is it? I'll oh, remember that, Luke. Where's my iPad? <laughs> Luke the judge. Right, guys, we're moving on to a serious situation now, okay? <clears throat> so, I've just got to find out which video it is. Being racist to you. So, this... Uh, Mods, can I have a trigger warning, please? Thank you, Linz. Can you put up a trigger warning, please, for me? Thank you. Oh, see, that's nice. Because with the hair. 
<laughs> Big love, Brittany and Sancho and Joe. Oh, thank you. Who did the trick? Who did that? Thank you to whoever did that. Right, guys. So, <clears throat> big love, Miss T. So, is this behaviour okay? Okay. Trigger warning. There are some uh, words here which aren't going to be very nice to hear. So, I'm going to try and beep at the right moment. But if I miss it, I'm sorry. You do care. I wasn't being. I said evil king. It's not really transphobic. Well, there you go, black bitch. Well, there you go. Black bitch. Yeah, that's good. Look at you. Yeah, look at what you just said to me. You would never ever say that to my face. Why would being racist to you? Why are you being transphobic? You do care. I wasn't being. I said evil king. It's not really transphobic. Well, there you go, black bitch. Oh, I'm yeah, sorry, guys. Good. Sorry. Yeah, look at what you just said to them. Oh, it's repeated. Sorry, the video repeated, guys. So, that was Eva Queen, Tori, and AR and M's last night. Okay. So, what is my opinion on this video? Right. I'm going to give my honest opinion. Thank you, guys. Can we not have any turkeys, please, while I'm talking about this? Because it's a serious situation. Thank you. I'm not being ungrateful, but... Okay, my opinion on this. Right, so... You was both as bad as each other, okay? I feel like transphobia is wrong and racism's wrong, but when it comes to EQ, uh, I feel like she does say the worst, okay? So it's hard for me to have sympathy for her. Uh, nevertheless, I do care about the rest of the trans community, okay? Uh, <coughs> it's hard for me to have sympathy for her. Uh, nevertheless, transphobia is wrong. Uh, and obviously evil queens reacted in that way and she's been racist now i can't be outraged by any of it because you know i'm not from the black community and i'm not from the trans community but racism really does hurt me uh because i i do have mixed race children and we have experienced what we've ex as a family we have experienced racism uh so racism it you know it hurts me uh because obviously it's affected us in some kind of way but I do feel like uh, even though what they said there was both as bad as each other uh, I just think evil queen I just think she's horrendous I'm not gonna lie it's horrendous um, yeah yeah I'm, I, I'm not both the both bad but I do feel like what evil queen said was horrendous you know, I think she gets away with too much. It's not the first time, you know, she's displayed this behaviour. You know what I mean? Um, and she, like, goes on about transphobia, but she's transphobic to Mama Kaz, Miss Faye, uh, Alpha Bar. You know, she, she doesn't say it's the worst. Do you know what I mean? Italian Anya to go back to her own country. Uh, do you get what I'm saying? Uh, but Torian shouldn't be transphobic. You know, that's wrong. 100%. They're both very sore subjects and both are from, you know, uh, protected communities, do you know what I mean? But I just feel like, I can't have, when it comes to Eva Queen, I can't have sympathy, I'm sorry. I can't. I really can't. But it's not right, what was said to Eva Queen, but Eva Queen, she just goes low, 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 you know. Uh, AR is vile, AR is vile, and now M's like defender. M's has been so transphobic to Evil Queen. Dead named Evil Queen, played man, I feel like a woman. Do you know what I mean? And M's is sat there outraged when M's has, M's has been transphobic herself. But this is what I'm saying. And the thing is with Evil Queen, there's no outrage or anything. At the, you know, there's no outrage, there's no repercussions, and it's just continuously that she's coming out with derogatory things. Like, uh, last week it was about kids, and so I can't have sympathy for, for people that talk sick on kids. I can't. But transphobia and racism, you know, it's equally as bad. Uh, I don't, I don't care who started it, 
I do think what Evil Queen said was below the belt. And I'm, I'm still going to be honest, just because we don't get on, I'm still going to be honest, you know? I'm not going to sit here. If I genuinely thought uh, Evil Queen was in the right, I'd, I'd stick up for Evil Queen like I did over the Ritz situation. Do you get what I'm saying? But she goes too far. It was too far. <clears throat> right, let me play some more videos. Look, never, 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 never. Oh, I've got to be careful what videos I'm playing. Uh. Right, is that the video? Yeah, please, do you why you're being tapped for a reason? You do care. Your nose is like a road that's never ending. Your nose is like a road that's never ending. I'm not. I'm not. No, let me say something. 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 Look at this hair, I'm happy with myself. If I want to change, I want to change. And you're so jealous of those sweaters, boys. I'm sorry, you're not happy with yourself. I do agree there, Tori, and she is jealous of me. That's why she's going for me all the time and she knocks everything about me, whether it be my looks, uh, my house, uh, the way I speak, the way I dress. Uh, she's all, She is jealous of me. I do agree with you there, Tori. I'm sorry, sorry, I am. So you described her as a black woman? Because she was transphobic to me, so I gave her a taste of her own medicine. So that's what you've actually well, You don't about. understand how it feels to be transphobic, baby. It's like, I don't understand how it feels to be racist. Yeah, but I'm not going to be racist. 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 I'm not going to and you laughed, you laughed when, you laughed when she called, she called Oi, and you see you, yeah. you frog looking girl as well. Your eyes are so close in between. Close <laughs> I'm not being funny, I am. I'm fucking out. Um, I was going now. Jenna. If Jenna didn't want to come back in, you invited her again, back in. Evil Queen wanted to come in to have their say. Has Evil Queen not got the right to come in and have their say? Yes, she has. It's unfortunate that it has been banned. Hopefully, she put back on a different account. I don't know. Yeah, look what you're doing. You're drinking alcohol, basically enabling racism right now. That's what you're doing. You're basically admitting to a neighbor. Well, she's gonna go for EQ and take this, that, and the other. About. Was it about you, though? Being transphobic. So are you, are yeah, but Ems, um, you've been so transphobic to EQ, so you can't sit there and say jack shit. You've dead named her, played songs on the off, played songs. You know, just because you and Evil Queen are like that now, doesn't give you the moral high ground, darling. Yeah, you have a fucking turkey, I don't know. You know, I'm saying, right, transphobia and racism is both, you know, it's it's bad. It's, you know, there's no, like, it's as bad as each other as far as I'm concerned. But I'm saying in this situation, what affected me the most, because as a family we've experienced, is it was the racism. It hit me harder. Do you know what I mean? And it's not because um, I, 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 dis I can't stand DQ, you know? Uh, but like I say, Evil Queen, she's uh, transphobic to um, Miss Faye, Mama Kaz, calls her men's. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, nobody should be saying anything like that to each other. Nobody. You know? <clears throat> and I, I, like I say, I've got trans friends, you know? 
I can't stand it when they've been attacked. But what I'm saying is, Evil Queen does the most and she gets away with it all because it's an act. And she's got this new ADHD thing. Thank you for the turkey, you know? But you've got to look at the stuff that she's uh, said previous. I'm sorry, I've got no sympathy when it comes to Evil Queen. No sympathy at all because she says the worst to everybody. Uh, and I'll stand on that and I'm not going to be bullied into having a different opinion. I'm not going to be bullied into having a difference of opinions. Yes, they are both hate crimes. Uh, no, it doesn't make Torian any better. It really doesn't. You know, they're both, they're, they're both as bad as each other, but EQ went really low. Uh, just saying it as it is. I'm not going to sit here and bullshit you. Um, you get what I'm saying? Uh, like, yeah, she told Danya to go back to her own country. Apparently, I haven't seen that video, you know. Um, and, and like I said, I'm not going to be bullied in my comments to think, you know, have your thought process. Uh, and Anna, Anna, sorry, Anna, you know, well, AR does go low. I'm sorry, I do think AR's a scumbag. I'm not going to lie. Uh, I'm not going to sit here and defend AR. He's a scumbag. Um, talking about. You know, Evil Queen isn't a woman because she can't have kids. Some some women can't have kids. I uh, doesn't mean they're any less of a woman. Do you know what I mean? Uh, someone just said, "So are you, Rob? You can piss off out of here, then, darling, with your twelve followers." Yeah. See you later, Rob. Don't cap. <coughs> you know. Um. Ah, oh, thank you, darling. Thank you. And I. Again, like I say, uh, I do find it hard to have sympathy for Evil Queen. What's, what, what, what was said to her, is it right now? Still transphobia, I'm sorry Torian, it is transphobic, but no sympathy for her. She says the worst to everybody, tells people to go on and unload themselves, talk sick on people's kids, sorry. When, yeah, but AR's not really, you know, you're going on about AR. I've spoke about, uh, oh, yeah, someone just said, what about Tori and Doxin? Tori and that was wrong, darling. You shouldn't have done that. Because even though Angie's address is already out there, there's a lot of people uh, that don't know Angie's address. Do you know what I mean? So I did think that was wrong, Tori uh, I'm sorry, Tori I, I, You know, I'm, I'm going to pull you up if it's on FYP and people are talking about it in the comments. I'm going to say what I think. Do you know what I mean? Uh, but then again, you know, it's one of them. Tori come on now, Tori I know. Come on. <laughs> but we'll open the boxes if Tori wants to come in and have her say. You know, she's more than welcome. Uh, just because I like you, Tori, and I still got to keep it real. Do you know what I mean? Um, yes. Yeah, I, I like Tori I do like Tori I think she's done a few fuck ups. But, you know, everybody learns, everybody's human. Do you get what I'm saying? Um, like that whole situation that happened before. Um, I ain't going to get my pitchforks out. Did I, uh, do I, did I agree with what Tori said? said? Um, you know, no, I didn't, but I ain't gonna get my pitchforks out and you know, let's get her off TikTok. <laughs> no, I appreciate it. Just, just quickly, yeah, just that e uh, the evil queen thing, yeah. So, obviously, we was in the live previously in it, and I said evil, evil king, but no one don't even, I didn't, I didn't say she was, I could have all been respond. there could have been an account called evil king in my live, like, I didn't even address it to her, like, I, do you get what I'm saying? So, when she came, she was like, oh, you've been transphobic, so I was like, yeah, all I said was evil king. I never said she's evil king. No one don't even know what I was responding to. So yeah, but you know, Torian, come on now. All, yeah. I think all you have to do is accountability, and as a creator, just do that. Yeah, yeah, I'll, t I'll take accountability. I'll take accountability for calling her evil king. I'll take, I'll take accountability. I will. I'll take accountability. Yeah. But I still don't like her. And you know, no, neither do I, Tori, and neither do I, but you know, at the end of the day, I know that people get you vexed and everything else, but it's all about trying to be better and, and do better, do you know what I mean? And I'm not, I'm not your mum, I'm not here to tell you off, because I ain't no angel, I've done some <laughs> fucked up stuff, do you know what I mean? Well, obviously, yeah. you know, I have to keep it real with you, you know, what you said was transphobic, but she was racist to you, you know? Um, 
and you've come up here and you know you've took it are you sorry for it though toria huh i'm sorry to the to if i offended the trans community yeah I there you go, guys. to the trans community if i offended anybody but um yeah that's really all about it and as for the other walking oh let me not sorry as for delusional yeah all right i said her address on the live because she was just too, she was doing too much miss red man she keeps talking she kept talking about my mum like every chance this woman gets i don't even go around her anymore so i did say her address but you see the address is i didn't think it was doxing because it's already out there Right, baby. Right, okay. That is, to be fair, if it's out on a pu public platform already, but there are people, Torian, that actually yeah. don't know her because she said it, then people that are new would, you know, they're going to get it. Do you get what I'm saying? I just think it doesn't matter how yeah. hard people can fly. And let me tell you from somebody that knows, don't go to them levels because it makes you know better, you know? Yeah, no, I, I hear that. I do. Um, I was wrong. Like, Torian, I hear that. we love you. And at the end of the day, evil queen needs telling about herself because she's absolutely disgusting, absolutely vile. Transphobia isn't um, the way to go about it. Oh, it's <laughs> been. Oh, it's been. Oh, it's been. Oh, it's been. Oh, it's been. It makes you it just as bad. What's it makes called? Just as bad. It's called. <gasps> <Frank's skin. laughs> I'm sorry. I think, you know, gender, being trans, is, that, that's that's a choice. Being born a colour, that's your colour, to be called it. It's not a choice to be transgender. Go and use the Google app and find out. It is not a choice. It's nothing to do with mental health. So go and learn. You want to have your bitch cut off, it's a choice. I'm sorry, that's how I feel. That's all I wanted to say. Torian, keep being you. And Torian, you rage baited yeah. her. You rage baited her. How did I rage bait her? She came into my life and said I was being transphobic. She then said to me, You called me evil king, and I was, and then I basically said, All I said was evil. What? Where did I bait her? Where? God, where? Torian did not say I'm evil didn't. king. Wait, where did I yes, bait she her? Did. I wanted to actually, uh, where, what part did I bait her? By saying evil king, no, she no, was no. using she an example. In, no, no, no. She was, let, no, let me finish, Torian, because we always speak over everyone. <laughs> she was using an example to say, well, you saying that to me, this is what it's like. No, you're lying. If I say no. to you, no, no, she no, came yeah. into the lab, yeah, yeah. yeah. No. She came into the lab and she goes, oh, I heard Torian was being transphobic to me. I then said to her, all I said was evil king. And then she said, well, you're a black bee. So what part of that doggy mama did I go to her? Did I go to her? Did I go in her life? Like, I she don't came, understand. She came into T Torian and their life knowing full well she was going to enjoy that. You're acting like it bothered her. It doesn't bother her what people say. Did you see her after AR? Did you see her after um, what AR said there? Well, tell it. Well, I suggest when she has a drink, right, maybe not come on the app just to bully us all. She wasn't bullying. Yes, she was. She went all the way she round. She was rage bearded. She was rage bearded and saying. No, she bullied everyone. She went to hustle. She went to Anna that lives in America. A she asked lady. hustle about where, about she his told baby Anna to go had back to her baby own country. Yet. She told Anna to go back to her own country. Her own. She never said one word to her. Torian, fair enough. She def defends herself. I get it, right? Yeah. The bad is each other, right? Okay. Torian are learning yeah. time. She's still young. She's still on this app learning stuff. I've been on the app. I've been doing Facebook and this 10 years. So you learn what to say and what not to say as you go along. It's part of learning. We all, we're all learning. The same as Miss Red. There'll be things she said she wouldn't say last year that she, that she said last year she wouldn't say this year. It's part of learning. You've got to give some people a bit of slack. Evil Queen has been doing this as long as I have. She knows exactly what she's doing to everybody on this app. And the she people does. like yourself. And there's things that she does it. say that I don't agree You're with. You're enabling this bullet. Yeah, but some of it, I'm a black community, don't deserve that. What have I done? And as part of the LGBTQ uh, community, no trans. Yeah, but you're not trans, that. are you? You're not trans, so it Yeah, but I'm part you. of the community. Yeah, well, she knows what she would do when she went in that room. I apologize. And so I did everyone else. I apologize for calling her Evil King. Um, 
I, I, like, and I she mean, apologized straight away to um do you Tori? No, she didn't, babe. No, she didn't. She, she said, yeah, she my, did. people <laughs> did me. my people will forgive me because I get away with everything. Sorry, lady. And she is says, I'm sorry a, if it's a fact, anyone. I didn't hear that. All that. Queen apologising. If there's an if there's a video of Evil Queen apologising, I'll play that video because I don't want to be biased. If she has apologised to Tori, and it's only fair that we hear that too. You know, because Tori has come up and said sorry. And I just want to make a statement. Like, um, I don't believe that you know being trans or being gay is part of mental health. It's it's you know it's how you was born. You can't help how you're born. Do you know what I mean? And I just want to say that because it was said earlier. My opinion. You can't help that the body that, that you're born in, you can't help that. Do you know what I mean? Thank you for that, uh, Miss Red. I've got yeah, two daughters. I've got two that. daughters in the LGQ. Listen, my, I've got two lesbian daughters. I'm not saying it was right. What I'm saying is she got drunk, so she couldn't go to work. So what she decided to do, because she wanted to earn a cross, like she kept saying all night, I need to still earn my money, I'm poor. Is that not what she said? Yeah. And then she went around the app just doing her thing, the evil queen thing. She did. Golden and this evil people. queen thing is boring us. She go to hustle. So she I did hustle. hustle. So she never said a word to her. Because she knew, she come on last night and she caused World War Three on TikTok because she knew. We'll be speaking about it today. She knows exactly what she's doing. And I know she's watching this now and she's laughing. She ain't bothered. She looks no. it. She's laughing. She looks it. And you're Come defending on. her. But Miss Red, sorry. sorry to share talk out of you. But Miss Red, I'm said, sorry. I know I'm saying this lady is spending her energy defending her. Why Evil Queen's laughing? No, <laughs> but Miss Red, we've got, to keep, we've got to stop. No, no, please, Did you Jody, see her last night after got... AR? We've got Coco. to stop call, saying, oh, it's because I'm drunk, it's because I'm drunk. That does not give you the right to go around calling people any names, whether you're gay or whether you're black or whatever. You should not be going round the app whether you're drunk and keep on blaming, oh, it's because I'm drunk why I said the N-word. It's because I'm drunk yeah. why I said the B-word. You can't keep on doing this round the app. It's not right. It's not fair on anybody, whether you're black, whether you're white or anything. I'm not sticking up for touring. I'm not sticking up for EQ. But no. I feel that the way it was said last night to touring was damn right disrespectful. The problems we have in our country at the moment, we can do without anybody being even worse. <clears throat> it's damn right ridiculous the way. It's dreadful the way Tori we spoke to, and I do apologise from a white person to a black lady. Oh, you have to I'm sorry, you should not. You should, I was damn right disrespect. I was disgusted with it, and I don't agree with what you say sometimes, Tori. And I don't. Yeah. I, I definitely don't agree with EQ. Definitely don't agree with her whatsoever. That sh you did not say EQ is an EK. You did not say that. You just say it. You just said EK. You did not mean it for her. It could have been meant for anybody. And it should not have been said that way. We've got enough problems in the world, Miss Red, we have. Without yeah, all this are. going on it's on the app. Like, you know, I've got no, you know, I've got no grievances with Torian, but I will speak the truth. I do think Torian knew what <laughs> you know, she said, I swear sorry. I didn't listen, I I was doing my own thing. She came and disturbed my my peace. I didn't say look, 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 look. Why I, I, I Look, I was wrong in it, and like that's it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Torian, it would have been different if you'd have gone and sat with her. Do you get me? If yeah. you'd have gone and searched her and then said it, it'd have been even worse. But like, what you've got to learn to do, Torian, I know it's well hard, man. I know it is, but we've got to kind of keep that shit low because there's so many different communities, and if we don't like it, then we shouldn't be doing it. Do you get me? Because mm. how's it going to make it? So we've got no leg to stand on. I keep saying that, and I ain't got a leg, you know. We ain't got no leg to stand on when when we're poking at them, and and then we don't expect it back. We have got to learn, and that's all I'm saying, Tori. Be careful what you say, because then when it comes to us being hurt, we we can't we can't then defend ourselves. We can't because we've already we've done things that cal calculates it. Do you understand what I'm trying to yeah. say to you? I mm -hmm. really like you, Torian. You, you're wired and you, you, <laughs> your temper is like zero to ten. And I love you and I respect you for what you're doing, but you're good 
will be taken away by the little things like that. Do you get what I mean? Yeah. I'll be real though, like I don't even go around these people anymore. Like I don't go around Angie. I don't go they just sit and just vent. I don't know what it I to be honest, I think Angie's bored, to be fair. And I think Evil Queen, she's just I don't, I don't know, man. She's just putting right. this persona on and right. stop saying when I say them, it's just a word. Them, they, that it's a word, it's not a me digging at anyone personally. Torian, Torian, can I ask you something? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Was you drunk last night? No. Tori, I don't, don't, I don't drink on a... <laughs> no, I don't even so, drink. Like so, 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 but it's okay. I just don't understand why it gives the rights for people like EQ and Zach the Brat to get absolutely legless and go on the app and say, go on the N-word and, and say that to you last night and say, oh, it was the drink, it was the drink, I'm sorry, but, and cry all over the app the next day and say, please, it's my MH and it's not MH. If you if you, you you drink, don't go on the app. Full stop. Keep off the bloody app. Don't go on the app and think yeah. oh, I'm going to go. This, these this, this is I'm how pissed. I look at the FYP pages, right? You near enough have to be squeaky clean to be doing one, but that's not that's not life, is it? That's not realness. He, we're all human. Miss Med Red makes mistakes. I make mistakes. Torian makes mistakes. Evil Queen makes mistakes. But when you go as low as Honestly, Torian, I wish Shanna said it. As low as that, and then colour and, Thank you very and much. places like that, then we've, we're all as wrong as each other. And I just wished, I know it's never going to be a peaceful act, but I do wish we could at least try and respect each other on who we are, what religion we are, where we're from, races, cultures. Do you know, I just wish that, honestly. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. I just want to hear from Trudy Scrumptious because uh, Trudy Scrumptious hasn't spoken yet. Trudy, do you want to unmute, darling? Yeah, I'm so Oh, Trudy Scrumptious, darling, do you want to unmute? I can't unmute your microphone. It's, uh, Kelsey, Kelsey, do you want? Oh, sorry, Trudy Scrumptious, I can't unmute for you. Kelsey, do you want to have your say? What's going on? Why can't people unmute? Because I can't do it. See, people are dropping out. Where's everyone going? Ah. Oh. Hi, hi, NJ. Hello, Miss Red. How are you? Long time. I'm good, thank you. How are you? I'm great, thank you. I'm great. Um, I just wanted to just say, look, yeah. If she was offended last night, then I'm going to be real good because the other week I seen a video of her talking about your children and how she don't care because people will forgive her. There is no consequence for this woman when she comes on the app going for people, saying vile stuff. And then the moment that she gets offended, this woman wanted to come up and say, oh my God, but, but what about the community? I'm going to be honest with you, I've spoken to people in that community and they don't want her as the voice for the community because she is vile and the way how she carries herself on this app is vile. So if she was offended last night, then I'm glad that she's offended and moving forward, watch how you're moving on the app because the things that you say to people is going to offend them, is going to um, cause stress and alarm on them as well. So. Like, if you don't want the clap back, then stop clapping at everybody on the app. And that's all I want to say on the situation, because I'm not going to just sit back and just hear people, oh, but evil queen is an evil queen that, when she's the one that says the most foil things on the app. So that's just my little two pence. And I don't even know the whole situation because I don't know what was said. But if she is offended, then good. The thing is, Ryan, you've also got to remember, okay, that... Obviously, Torian, you know, she was transphobic, so that also, you know, it, it affected the trans community and Eva Queen was a racist and that offense of, you know, the black community. It's not the two of them that are going at each other, it's also the other people that are affected, you know, from, you know, each community. You know what I'm saying? It's bigger than just two people, you know? Let's say if it was an innocent person, Miss Red, then maybe it's, it's, it's different especially if they didn't say anything and they was attacked. I'd get it and I'd be saying, yo, that's taking it too far. But this is a person that goads people 
great space. Like the list is endless with this woman. So at the end of the day, she goes around. She don't care. She goes for everybody. So really and truthfully, I can't sympathise with somebody like that. And I just say, she was racist before she even came in my life because she told that Anna woman to go back to our country before she even had the interaction with me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Guys, does everybody want to come in? Guys, just speak random. Oh, does we have Jim Cena in here? I think Jem's has been dropped. I think it was a fake one. What's going on? Can we get Hustle in? Oh, that other one. He just came in. Right, if Hustle requests, join Hustle. I did see Mama Kaz in here. I don't know if Mama Kaz wants to jump in because I'd like to have her opinion on it, to be honest, as well. Um, can I, Monsieur, can I just say something? As well. See you, uh, see you, can I just say something? See you, see you, uh, see you. Go on, Paula. Sorry, Jim. Can I just say something? See all this hate towards other creators. You know, why Why is it? Can you all just not stay in your own lane? And see this hate against Miss Red. I'm going to swear here. It fucking kills me to see this woman upset. You know, why can't you all just stay in your own lane? And, you know, if you don't like each other, just stay away from each other and have done with it this app is so toxic it really is and to see creators um being picked on day in and day out week in and week out it's fucking heartbreaking you no know, please stop it there's no need for it these are adults exactly paula that's right you know okay. i mean i love miss red and i tell you what i Miss Red's talking about all these creators, Evil Queen and all the rest of it. I don't want, the only person I watch in this app is Miss Red because she's, you know, she's true to what she says, you know what I mean? But stop picking on each other, leave each other. If you don't like each other and this, calling people this name and calling people that name, there's no need for it. There really isn't. You know, we're going through enough in the world. You're only here yeah. for a short time. You're not here for a long time. That's all I want to say. Thank you, Miss Red. Oh, thank you, darling. Absolutely. She, she's right. I'll just, just have my say. I, I have um, a so I, I can't really speak a lot. I'm just say good morning to her. And I just want to say how many people in this um, live are actually parents? I bet nearly all of you are parents. I even uh, EQ sat and said about Pearl opening her FLIPSs and sitting on a grand door at the grandchild's face. Mm -hmm. How many of you in here are still supporting that? If that was a man on this app or anybody else on this app, you would be roaring about it. But because she can say it to me, and I'm going to say this and people can come for me, she has pedlo thoughts, the things that she comes out with. I am raging. People were going around yeah. the last night about a guy on here, Miss Red. Oh, and Michelle, Michelle, I love her to death. And she brought on about a guy um, that they're looking into because of all this. But EQ is saying the same things, but nobody is going for her. And all of you in here are mostly parents. And you're all in there gifting her. And she gifted her a lion. The oh, same. Okay. Where's the right in all this, you lad? You need to stand up and you need to listen. You are enabling somebody that comes out and says, sit in grand people's faces in graphic, graphic things. Right. It, you exactly. know, and I don't agree with everything Torian says, and I don't agree with them going at each other last night. But the pedal thing on this, I'm sorry, you can all come for me. I don't care. She has also gone for people that like that have nearly took their own lives and told them to get ro get ropes and stick it around the neck. But Zach, oh no, poor Zach. Everybody's oh poor Zach, poor Zach. No, this is wrong, and you all got to look up to what this woman is saying, and you're all bloody gifting her. Now you all. Are encouraging and enabling this woman to do this. Definitely, and, it's, and you're all parents. It's got mm -hmm. to Canadian Angie, all of them. Yo, Miss Red. Hello, Dan. Obviously, we don't really get on. And uh, after my birthday, I told my kids I'm not doing TikTok again. I'm not doing TikTok again. I've done four years. I'm not doing TikTok again. Last night, EQ came onto my page after a year. I don't chat to her, I don't chat to you, don't chat to a couple of you. And she came on with a smile or whatever, and we had a, a big argument. I can't remember what it was over, to be fair. She got her coins and she bounced. Um, I just came off because I thought, why are you trying to embarrass me? You know, I've been embarrassed as much 
you know what I'm saying? Then apparently the Torian thing happened and it'll just go on and on and on. It'll never get stopped. I think that you're stupid for ever being brethren's in the first place with that. And like, yeah, respect, you got to do your morning thing and express, you know, what we're all doing and rare, rare. When I was crazy last year, got sections, you know, everyone has to get outed on Miss Reds. But, and I understand it, but you let Evil Queen, like, I don't know, you let Evil Queen kind of, don't know. Yeah, I did gift her the other day so I could draw her out. Yeah, I did. I told her straight last night I gifted you because I knew you'd come over to me so I could draw you out. So what? Three gifts. What? Off an account that I don't cash out on. I wanted to draw her out. Now what? Yeah, I stood up to her, but she ain't ever going to come and link me so we can get down and dirty. This all started with me, Chelsea and EQ in 2022. Oh, and Alpha Bar and Mama Kaz. It will never stop. And that Zach thing. It will never stop. I'm just not scared of EQ. Miss Red, you're going to have to tread carefully, I reckon, to... I don't even think you will, you know, because your name's Don Aaron. Like, I think you'll be <laughs> sound, but... <laughs> if you had a came, if you had a stayed brethren's with her, you would have fucked up your shit, bro. She's ready to take your page down, mate. She's ready to disintegrate you the same way she's done it to Chelsea, Leah, Mama Kaz, oh, no. Alpha Bar. Me, she's ready to really get your platform gone. So when oh, I come no. on your platform, you better be nice to me because really and truly I'm gonna stay on your side. Oh well I'll be nice to you then, Jem. Big up Jem. There we go. I don't care who hates me and all that. I'm disappointed in the evil queen last night because if she had spoke sensibly to me, like a normal conversation, I'd have said, you know what, EQ? Yeah, we fell out or whatever, and you think you're a bad girl and rare tear tear. I get your business, but she didn't do that. She 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 got me to be nice to her, and then she started to try and come for me. But I knew that was the pattern, so I was ready. I was on smoke for her last night. Are you mad? I, I might have lost the battle. I lost the battle in coins, but in talking, I didn't lose the battle. I said everything correctly. Whereas a year ago, I would have been screaming, shouting, ga ga ga. Fuck EQ. She idiot gal. Her sofa. Have you seen her sofa? No, oh I haven't. Oh my God, she's got the cheapest sofa ever. <laughs> yeah, what I'm, what I'm, what I'm taking Yo, from her sofa is so cheap. She's Didn't been telling know. everyone about the sofa, yeah? Didn't you know? Everyone can't wait to get my sofa. Next Hello, thing you know, the sofa comes and it's from a fucking charity shop, bro. I had that sofa like three years ago, mate. She's on some old style, bro. She's way back <laughs> when. She ain't got a clue, mate. Girl's still rocking her fringe. I'm wearing it as a fake wig. You get me? I as well, to be honest. I think what, what I'm saying is... The girl's yeah. a sausage. Oh, She's Jim, lucky that anyone's ever had respect you, yeah? for her. Jim, what I'm, getting, what? what I'm gathering from this is that you gifted her 5K and because she won't gift it you back, you want to throw her under the bus now? <laughs> no, because it didn't come from an account that I get gifted from. It will be honest, Jim. That's what it is, ain't it? Is that you, NJ? Yeah. I don't know you. I don't speak to people like you. Basically, that's not what it is because EQ is never going to give me back. I got gifted from Kapesh. I patterned my ting. I patterned my ting. I rinsed EQ's gifters last week on my birthday, gifted her 5K off a fake account, what I had, and that's proven on FYP. And then, boom, she came over to me thinking I'm going to be a brethren. She said two, two words, and I dropped the ice block on her. And she melted. Then what? You're going to melt as well. I'll see you later, Miss Reds. Anyway, I ain't got time for this. I need to go wash my panani, darling. Oh, okay, thank and you, Gemma, darling. Can you do me a favour, Miss Red, because you do my heading. Can you at least get a bottle of water that's full? Because it gets my anxiety rattled. Stop drinking yeah, some dirty water, man. Ross, Clark. Come on, Gemma, I've got dry mouth from medication. Tell it I'll dehydrate. But, guys, can I just say the one thing I don't agree with sofa shaming? Do you know what I mean? Because I personally haven't seen the sofa, but I'm sure it's lovely. Whether it's from a charity shop, Argus, S, whatever the fucking word is, we'll have no sofa shaming around these ways. All right, because mine's still crushed velvet. Anyway, hustle, go on, darling. Yes, yes, what's happening? What's going on, hustle? Uh, I don't know, what do you want me to talk about? I don't really care about it, to be fair. It's 
the best. I wanted to talk for what so was you after some followers, I guess. Oh, I thought I thought you wanted me to talk on some shit. <laughs> no, Torian said join the box. Oh well, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Evil Queen attacked me, man. I was I was hurt. Mm -hmm. She was goading you, hustle yesterday. <clears throat> yeah, man. Do you know what is? I, I didn't even... see that you bustle. What happened? Nah, so listen, you remember I had a situation on here that like anyone that was respectable did not speak on it. I like that speaks on stuff. I yourself, Zach, all of these people that was none of you spoke on it, right? Out of respect. And uh yesterday, um when I was live, she she requested I was live with Anna, we were just doing our normal thing that we do every night. And then um she starts like really poking a bit. I wasn't saying nothing, I was being quiet. I was like, no, no, no. Do you know, just like trying to brush past it mm. and then try to then talk, uh, try to then bring normal conversation up. And then she, she continues to poke some more, some more, some more. So I was like, bro, do you know what? You're trying to poke into my personal life. How about we, we poke into your personal life? So then I, I asked her a question. Um, how was life before your transition? And I don't care how that sounds. You asked me about my personal life. I didn't, I didn't say or do anything transphobic. I just asked you a question. Same way you asked me a question. I, I reeled you in same way you reeled, reeled me in. I don't give a fuck. There's nothing bad that I said. I want, to know about, I want to know about your life same way you want to know about my life. If you're interested, I'm in, interested. Because in reality, I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck about your life. Why do you give a fuck about my life? I was doing my, I was minding my business, doing my thing, and then, um, then obviously, uh, then I, I asked her about, I said about the, the racism stuff and all of that, and then she tried to then say, huh? Sorry, mouth sneezing or so. And then um, her, her little friends then tried to like. Try to twist the whole little narrative and just be weird. I don't know. I don't really care, to be honest. Like like I said last night, I'll go and do my thing as I do every single night. I'll go and have fun and, and do what I'm doing. Negative people do negative things and discuss negative situations with, as much as they want. I'm here to have a laugh, bruv. This is TikTok. Yeah. I didn't even know about that whole soul I haven't seen it all, to be honest. Yeah, man. And then after that, she's, yeah, she's, then, telling, she's then telling Anna to get back to her country and all of this shit. Like, it's all weird, bro. Like, what, what's wrong with you? And then Canadian Angie and that went on their live and tried to push a narrative that Hustle said that he was gonna hit. Yeah, so when I was speaking about the racism thing with uh with EQ, um what I said to EQ was uh what did I say? She she basically uh, made it out to be a joke. And I was like, it's not a joke though. I was like, if you if you um basically say that around the wrong person, somebody might want to do something to your face. And then Canadian Angie's then trying to say, oh, did he just say he would hit a woman in the face? Da -da? Like doing all of this weird shit. But I'm like, you lot are strange, bro. Doesn't mean you'd be transphobic. I wasn't transphobic. I just asked her, how was, how was life before? Let me tell you something. You can't be transphobic if you ain't got hatred in your blood for... Come on, man. Shut up. You know one thing that, I, that, that I'm like... That I, that I think about is, you know, the person that was in the middle that came up that come to defend Evil Queen. When Evil Queen does all the stuff that she does on the app, does she hold her accountable or is she just laughing in the comments like, yeah, go on, find her? Don't hold her accountable. They tremble around her. They're, you see, Canadian Angie and Kales and everyone that's they are scared, scared of Evil Queen. Yeah. I'm telling you. Because who remembers when Canadian Angie was sitting on her platform calling Evil Queen a peddler? No one ever, I don't forget things, you know. Mm. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. But yeah, it's just a bit weird. Sorry, go on, Miss Rick. Oh, yeah. I'll be reading. I just want to hear Kaz's time. What do you think about the whole situation? Really, really Hi, Torian. What I want to say is, like, I've been friends with Torian for some time on this app. She's never, ever been transphobic to me. Now, what I will yeah. say as a trans person, I do feel like there is a difference between being racist and transphobia. And I'm saying that from a trans person, okay? Yes, obviously, that it comes under, you know, discrimination. But what, you know, the black community has been through, you know, it's, it's absolutely awful. So what I will say is, now, what I'm going to say is, 
evil queen picks and chooses when she wants to be trans. She's so quick to sit there and be transphobic towards me and other people in the trans community. And she claims many, many times that she's not trans herself and she's a woman. So, you know, she's quick to pick and choose when she wants to be trans. So I personally don't think she cared about what was said to her. I think she knows exactly what she's doing and I think it's all for gifts and that's why she makes a big deal about it. She picks and chooses when she wants to be a trans person on this app. But then she's quick to attack me for being trans, other people for being trans, because we're not as far as her in her journey. So yeah. how can you be affected by transphobia when you come on this app, you've said you can have periods, you class yourself as a, as a woman. I don't class myself as a, I don't even class myself as a female, I'm a trans woman. You know, and I can say that loud and proud, because I'm not going to sit here and take away from any female and what they've been through as a biological woman, because I will never go through that as, as a trans person. So she's quick to pick and choose when she wants to be trans or when she doesn't want to be trans. So no, I don't think she gives a, f a, a sorry, my language, an F what Torian said. She, this isn't the first time she's been racist on this app. She's been racist on many occasions. And I don't think she cares about any transphobic words that I said to her, because she makes it very, very clear on top that she's not trans. What Evil Queen likes to do, she likes to pick and choose when she wants to back the trans community. That's what she does. Back. She doesn't stand by us as trans people. She puts trans people down. She's put me down because I'm nowhere near as her in her in her Delulu world. Just because I haven't had my iOS update, babe. And I ain't Megatron priming like you, darling. Sorry. And I'm saying it from a trans person. So yeah, I don't think she cares. I think she chooses when she wants to be outraged by things. This isn't the first time she's been racist on this app. And, you know, this is the first time I've heard Torin say something out of line. She's apologised for it. I appreciate your apology, Torin. You've never been transphobic towards me. Um, and I don't think she gives a shit. That's all I'm saying. Bye, guys. Bye. Okay, thanks, Kaz. I think that she um, she came on yesterday looking for trouble. She had had a drink, and from the lives I saw her in when she was live with people, she was looking for trouble. And it's really difficult to speak on this when you're not a, a trans person. Everyone just screams transphobia, but people respect her her to call her she her. Do you know what I mean? So. I know she does get transphobia on this app, but then I have seen her as well be transphobic to people like Mama Kaz, like um, Miss Faye, like Elphaba, like everybody um, on here who's going through their own transition. And for me, if you are respecting that somebody wants to be called she and you're doing that, like, I, I feel like transphobia is thrown around a lot and it's an excuse for her to be able to say, like, she said what she said. And I knew... Like I was watching her after and she said, oh, I can't believe I've done that. She knows that she's gone too far with what she said to, to Torian. And it's not the first time that she said something outrageous, like we expect it from her. But this, this transphobia thing and all the people that heavily support EQ, straight away what they jump to is, oh, you're transphobic, you're transphobic. It's thrown around too much. Torian calls her she, Torian calls her woman, we all do. Do you know yeah. what I mean? It's just. Oh, you know it's, what, Asia, I've never seen her as anything other than a woman. You yeah, know, I've, I've, she's I've, just I've, evil queen. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I agree. Hi, hi Kay. Kay. I'm out of here. All right, take care, Hustle. Hi, hi Kay, Kay's. Hiya. Um, I just want to say, obviously, I have been listening oh, all morning, and uh, there's a few things I don't agree with. Uh, Torian, you you did lie when you said that, um, and you came in and attacked your mum. That was that was a lie because you requested her four times, and she told you to stop requesting her. So it was classed to me as goaded. Don't agree with uh, what Eva Queen did, and I certainly don't agree with what Torian did. And yeah. for the comment that was made at the start about um, I do think racism is worse. Everybody. Everybody, different things affect people differently. If I was trans, trans is going to affect me more than the racism. So no, nobody can, can say, oh, well, that one was worse and this one was worse. Nobody can do that. And that's all I just came up here to say. But, yeah. 
I want, okay, thank you, my darling. Thank you. People are saying facts 100%. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Also, as well, I would like to get, if we've got any EQ supporters in here, I don't want this to be like, you know, I hate live. So if you, if we do have EQ supporters, can you put me in the comments and then we'll get you in the box? Because obviously I want you to have your say, you know, I don't want it to be all biased and shit. Uh, but thank you. Uh, thank you very much. She hasn't spoken yet. Hi. Who's person in the middle? Because it's just an emoji. Do you want everybody on mute? I, I can't unmute you guys. Can I just, like, I keep seeing comments saying, oh, Torian was baiting her. Torian, if you're <laughs> racist, you're racist. Like, you can't bait someone to be racist. Because I could argue with Torian and I wouldn't use racial slurs towards her or call her a black anything. Like, there's no baiting about it. Okay. Thank you, Alicia. Hi, Jay. Hello. Yeah, I agree with Alicia as well. Um, there's no need for this racial shit. It's every it's every chance that EQ gets. It's like the lowest blow she could possibly use. Um, start going on about colour. It's not just Torian that um, she's gone for with colour. She told a very good friend of mine as well to go and rub cow shit on her skin to make herself look darker. She's a fucking evil bastard. That's what she is. Need to stop buying her vaginas from Team U and get a fucking life. Oh. That's oh, my view on it. Have a nice day. Thank you. Thank you. I don't agree with the, the vagina comment. I've got to say, Jay. Well, I do because it's from. Well, I do because it was from botched. Oh, Jay, we can't be saying things like that, darling. Sorry. Uh, guys, can we be respectful about body parts and everything? Do you know what I mean? Because you you, you do lose the argument. I'm sorry. Yeah, it makes uh, yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't agree with that. I, I really don't. Uh, but thank you, Jay. Have we got? I just want to know if we've got EQ, any UQ supporters. Can you put me and I'll put you in the box, please? Uh, guys, it's not funny. I'm serious. Yes, me, Laney. Right, hang on, let me find you, darling. Mods, if Laney's in the box, can you put her in, please? I can't see anything. Um, there's an account with a picture of my mum on. Can someone, sorry, can someone block it? Yeah, guys, can you, can you, can you block that account for Alicia, please? Hi, thanks for accepting. Um, yeah, no, I just, um, like, I don't agree at all with um, racism at all. But the fact is that, Torian, you did um, be transphobic to EQ, which was totally wrong. And what else was she going to come back with that was going to hurt Whoa. you? Hurt you? To be fair, it like I said, yeah, I, 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 all I said was, all I said was evil. I didn't direct it to her. She came and she said what she said. So, you look like, like I, I, I generally, to be honest, yeah, <clears throat> I hear what you're saying. Yeah, I said what I said was wrong, but no one directed it actually to her or anything. Well, like, she said evil. Life. She's called evil queen. So, like, so there's a I, lot I of evil, evil kings and evil avocado and all these evil people that come in my life for and who be addressing a comment but yeah like brand of a narrative so but like, like who whenever when the whole evil avocado thing evil turn up evil evil plum evil everything was going on who all were we focusing that back on to it was evil queen and now i'm not standing up really at all for it. racism but i'm just stating the fact that's what happened last night and like I'm not saying anything like you're no victim and everything else here. I didn't say I was a victim. Did we're you not, say I was a victim? I'm still speaking. We're not okay. going to sit here and pretend that everything else is good. What you've done. Uh, look, at, look at what happened with Gypsy Queen's son. Look at everything there. No one's going to forget what happened there. Okay. Like, it was, it was I horrible. Don't care if you or not. Like, yeah, and yourself as well. Really like, again, last night too, you pushed everything back on Angie. 
How did I push everything back on? You've brought stuff back about her mother and all that you there. About me and I said, you need to go look after your mother. Yeah. Understand, like, you're coming at me. Do you know what, Lynn? No, I've heard enough. I hate when you lot come, yeah? You People lot? Like you. What, yes, you. I'm talking about done? you. People like you that come up and say, oh, you did this, you did that. But you never, you ever... Hello, that. I'm talking, babe. I'm talking. You did do you that. You never... No, I didn't. You never, ever come and tell me what you did. Hello, I'm talking. Can you, you stop You did do that to Gypsy Queen's son. No, you can you stop? Her we're, not talking about, nice. but we're not talking you about... You did Gypsy go at Angie about her mother constantly. Torian's problem is that she gaslights everybody and doesn't admit to what she said. Oh, so shut up, man. When exactly. you first came on here, you tried to say, I could have said it about anybody, blah, 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 blah. No, you knew full well what you were doing. You were guiding her. She yeah. wasn't what even evil. Do you know what's mad? Do you know what well. you're saying? I'm going there, but wait, hold right. on. When I said evil king the first, the first time before, she, she wasn't even in my life. She wasn't even in my life. So yeah, but you, you knew about? people were going to go onto her live and tell her what you were how saying. How did I know? And we wasn't even talking about her. So what are you talking about? Well, when people talking about so how was about I going? When I said lives, Evil King, no one was even talking about Evil Queen. He came in the live after. But then what you said afterwards about what? Captain what? Hook and you got a big nose. I was talking about that, her nose. Yes, nice, because she yeah. had already said the racial comment. Like, I don't understand what we're doing here. Two wrongs don't on and on and on. Bro, I called her. I said she's got a long nose. Like, I don't understand. Like, I don't get... You said it was like a hook? Yes, so I said Captain Hook. Go back to never... Like, what are we doing here? Like, I don't so get... So, because Torian said about her nose, what? is it okay that she was racially abused? Is that what you're Nobody saying? Nobody said that. I've just said two wrongs don't make Alicia. a right. Who, I never said two wrongs make a right. Who, what happened first? She called her evil king. If there's no, fit. It was, he went he into the live on the his shoot, for Listen, the shoe fitted and she wore racially. End of discussion. A conversation. There was no need for it to even get that bad. It didn't need to go to that horribleness of a conversation. It was horrible the way it went. Like two wrongs don't make a right. It was. Uh, there was no need for it to go that way. Can I ask a question? What did this Anna Anna say to be told to get back to her own country? Nothing. I know that. I know it. Nothing. I know. I know exactly what was said. I was in the chat. I was well, in the EQ's live. She, Miss, what's her name? Evil Queen was like to Anne, oh, so that's the people you like to associate yourself with, people that are uh, uh, transphobic or whatever. And then she was like, off you go, go back to your country. Yeah. That is exactly what happened. Anna didn't say nothing to her. I mean, to be right. fair, that's very Can I have my say, Miss Red, sorry, please? Can me say, Tori, you don't feel called upon, do you, darling? No, no, I'm good, I'm good. Hi, Miss Clay. Hi, yeah. Thank you for letting me up. Um, I just wanted, to, uh, you know, get some home truths out there. I was on the whole live of EQs, and I, I don't obviously, you know, back her hundred percent of what she's done. Um, but when she invited Hustle and Anna, is it Anna or Anna? I don't want to get a name wrong. Um. Obviously, EQ was asking Hustle about um, something about has he had the baby yet? And he was going, oh, what what baby, what baby, what baby? So EQ was basically saying to him, I'm sure it was you that was having a baby and all that. And, you know, I just wanted to know if you had the baby. So then obviously it got um, out of control and Hustle brought up, okay, then you're bringing my life into it. So why not I bring up your life? What was it like being, you know, before you, you know, got been changed sort of thing? Um, so, and then that come, that come on about. And then um, Hustle went off and then EQ turned around and said to Anna, um, you know, what do you think of this situation? Is he is he right or is he wrong? And then Anna just turned around and said, oh, no, he's a lovely guy. You're a lovely girl. She, basically, I don't want to take any part of it. And then EQ is uh, turned around and said, well, get back to your own country and then cut her off. Then um, I think it was Gem Zeno come on. Um, yeah. But before Gem Zeno come on, she was gifted. Gem Zeno was gifting um, EQ. And then obviously, I think uh, Gem Zeno must have gone live. And then she come on. They were chatting and that. And um, 
she uh gems you know bought uh up um andrew called her andrew and that went off and off so then obviously Gemzino dropped a thing so and that's when Torian come up and then there was um, a big discussion about that and everything like that and all I heard was uh, Torian call uh, EQ a evil king and no I know it's not obviously like at her but let's be honest you run alive with her y you know you but that, Do you know what I mean? He came in my life and asked. She said, Torian has been transphobic. She called me thing. And I said, all I, I said, I, I said, evil king. No, I didn't actually call her evil king to her directly. So that's not what happened. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, Torian. It, it, I know for the fact that you're saying that you haven't actually called her face to face. But let's be honest, you're on a live with her. You're talking to her and you said that to her. If that makes sense. I wasn't on the live with her. She came into the live with me, Aeon, I don't remember who the other person was, and she asked me, and I said, all I said was evil queen. When I said her initial comment, she was not in the live. Okay, fair enough. And then, well, that's how I, I think it anyway. And then, obviously, that's why EQ went at her and called her a, a BB. I don't want to say it because I'm not, I'm not racist, so, but yeah called her a bb but that's what i that's what i do anyway that's what i've heard and i just wanted to put my point across because I, as soon as like i've come in here miss red and it was all just you know like um you know just roaring at each other and i was like no that you know what i wanted to put the home truths out there so right. yeah that that's me that's me done thank you for letting me up no i have problem. a quick question if it's okay um to lane and amy i, I just wondered because you know i'm all about accountability over here and you know when evil queen does say things like you know when she's mocking sa and she's telling certain people to go and do stuff to their grandkids do you come up and do you have your say on that or are you quiet or do you agree with those kind of sentiments because if i have a, f a favorite creator etc and they're going around the app saying that then i would say something so I'm just yeah evil person. queen says loads of things that are out of order and she's really wrong she needs to start taking accountability as well for the horrible things that she says but i think and i don't like how evil queen bashes people that she thinks are going to be doing weller than her you can tell that she just wants the gifts and stuff but in this situation i think they're both as bad as each other okay and the same yeah. question to lane as well yeah well to be honest i like evil queen she's not my favorite creator at all i like angie and one thing about people taking accountability and having people on their platform you back Torian to a T um, which I kind of find hilarious after what happened with Gypsy Queen and her son which is debolical Lane, Lane, I feel like you're deflecting I just asked you no I'm trying to speak um, which is debolical after what happened with her son and so then as well about my children. do you think it's okay um, for her to play recordings of my children and say that I actually abuse and abuse my children that was all said after, was it not? No, it wasn't, because if you go on, um, I think it's true something, if you actually go right, on that. Yeah, show, and you know who runs that account. You know who runs that account. End, end you know who runs that account, don't you? So I'm, not going, I'm not going through this all again. Who runs that no, account? But you keep mentioning account? it, so you seem like you so, want to go through it over and over again. Are like, you still know. Are you still trying mate, to say mate, what sorry, you mate, said? Sorry, mate. Mate, this, this isn't a gang up or anything. I just wondered if you could just answer my question. Would do you Do you hold her accountable? when she says stuff you know like wishing SA on people's children or telling people to go and SA people's children or wishing I'm, saying, I, I'm telling you right now she's her. not my favorite creator you don't, I'm, I don't like, like I, your favorite what she says what she Sorry, says being... let me speak what she says like isn't right some of the stuff of what she says of course not who's who's going to support some of the stuff she says she she has come out and said the stuff she said about Pearl and the kid that was wrong 
Well, come on. So are you uh, are you then agreeing then that the stuff that prepared has said about orangutan and all them their things? And are you going to say that they're, uh, they're okay? I was just saying, love. Do you still do? You, would you come up and have the same sentiment? Do you know what I mean? When she said what she said, did you like, come up and say, you know what, she's wrong? No. Didn't I just answer that? Like, there's people currently oh, in this live as well. Like, you have Alex Brigham, who said about the chair and the crab paste. You know, the thing he, is... He was kept from the slave before, and he's currently back sorry. in here. NJ Lane supports Angie, and that just tells you everything you need to know. Like, oh. there's just, there's no point speaking to these people. They're very brainwashed, and it's scary. Well, well Alicia, four your four best friend sports. is Torian, who mocked knife crime. So, to be honest, anything you say is just dog wash to me. Oh, I'm so upset. Well, I think it's yeah. not a blame game, though. I think both creators were wrong, and they both need to take accountability for what they've both said. It's both. Amy, I agree with you, but you know, in, in these terms, when these stuff happen, it seems like people just like like um, paper over the cracks of what the other creator is, and oh, we should all feel sorry for Evil Queen. I'm sorry, I can't feel sorry. Yeah, for I think Evil Queen thinks she can get away with saying things because she's got so many followers and stuff that support her, which is really wrong. Enablers. Yeah. Deluded man. She's part of the deluded crew. I wasn't going to jump up because I was mentioned. Of course, I was going to be mentioned. That this is what happens. You see, unfortunately, but it's cool because if we're going to play the deflection game, I'm going to play it back at you. You do know yet on the. Alex, when I, went, I do oh, not. No, no, no. Let me speak. Let me speak. Now. I'm going to point. I'm going to point the finger now, right? Abuse. You are okay, okay, okay then, okay then. We're gonna we're gonna play disgusting. that game now. I'm gonna play Ms. the game Freya back now. Ms. Freya said that she wasn't gonna be friends with you. Donna. Brought you I'm back on the game back now. Okay, I'm gonna play the game back, back, back now. You are disgusting. Oh, okay, yeah, I'm disgusting. You know what? I'm I'm absolutely outrageous. I am absolutely outraged, disgusting. Whatever you want to say, but you do know the other day when I was live and stuff, and I said. Eva Queen said she was going to open her flaps and sit on Pearl's granddaughter's face. And I said, you, Angie, gifted her after that, right? And you and you laughed about it. So at the end of the day, right, what did I do that was so wrong when you now in here supporting Angie and she's gifted someone saying that she's going to sexually you're grab right. No, you're fine. There's no excuse in what you said. Oh, you sent your dick no around to women and then you mocked down to you. Selective outrage. Who do you think you are? You're, you're just disgusting. hypocrites. You're all hypocrites, right? And it's selective keeps, outrage. It's all keep the saying your little mushroom around and mocking childhood sexual oh, abuse. You're but, absolutely you've got, you've got, you've disgusting. You've got the recording. You've got the recording. Listen back to it. This is the problem on this app now, right? It's selective outrage. It's all, I got brought into this. It's got nothing to do with me. People keep not, instead of sticking to the task at hand and discussing the racism and the back and forth, the transphobia, it always gets brought back up previous things and it goes round in a vicious circle and it continues. And this is why it always going to continue on the app. There's always going to be a back and forth. And this is what pisses me off about this app now. Because you know what? Everyone's looking to point the finger. Always looking to point the finger at someone else and get them the deflection, the blame game. It's disgusting. I'm going to jump down. You know what it is, right? I'll be live in a bit, in a bit. Okay. I'll speak to you soon, Alex. It, it is, though, isn't it? It's a blame game. That but It doesn't matter what somebody else said. Let's go off track and just, like, well, you said this, like, six months ago. Do you know what I mean? Uh, when it's got nothing to do with the situation. So, yeah, I agree. Yeah. Uh, who hasn't spoken yet? Hi, Magsy. Magsy, do you want to unmute? I can't unmute. Has anybody else got anything they want to say? Um, and then I'm going to close the live down. Now, I'm just thank you for having me up here, Miss Red. You take care, all right? Oh, no problem, NJ. Yeah, thank, thank you, thank you as well. Thank you. No, I'm doing thank as well. Okay, thank you for joining, Alicia. Thank you. May, have you got anything that you wanted to add? Hello, May. Right, guys. So, again, uh, I know that some of the topics of conversation have been hard to hear today, but you're not obliged to sit in. You can leave at any time. Uh, but thank you to everybody that joined the box. I did try and make the boxes fair. I just added whoever was requesting. Thank you, Steph. Yeah, big up, Alex, because at the end of the day, right, uh, people are constantly throwing that on him to deflect off other situations. Do you know what I mean? But it's just the way it is. It's all selective outrage, isn't it? Uh, on TikTok. Uh, 
yeah, selective outrage. Um, no problem, no problem. Yeah, I'll, yeah, exactly that, Ashley. I, I will pick up Alex because, you know, he's having things like that thrown in his face all the time. So, you know, a, a mistake was made, held his hands up and, you know, he's just going to be punished for the rest of his TikTok time when people have said 50 times worse and continue to say it, you know. Um, yeah, hustle's mm -hmm. been in the box, guys. Uh, this isn't me being biased. This is just me being honest, you know. Uh, again, thank you for everyone. To, and you're not going to tell me off for defending my friend when I know he's a good guy. I don't give a fuck what anybody else thinks. I know he's a good guy, all right? But what we can't keep on doing is, like, dragging somebody for making a mistake, you know. Um, people are human and people make mistakes. If he was doing it every day of the week, it would be a different situation. Uh Firstly, I'd like to apologise if I've um, come in in a sort of ag aggressive way because it's not my character. However, I'm also going to defend myself. And this is the problem here, you know, Donna, is other people are continuing this thing. Like, it was mad how I've been brought into this whole situation from an Angie supporter. It isn't Angie directly. It's one of Angie's supporters. Yet again, this now will escalate into me and Angie having a back and forth yet again today. This is what's going to happen. Because of support yeah. now, and it isn't Angie directly, it's people bringing it up now. So now Angie's going to respond, and then I'm going to respond, and here we go, back, forth, back, forth. It, it, it's and, and people are saying, oh, my God, what you said about um, the bridge comment. Yeah, I did. I said it, and I'll say it again. I'll stand it with confidence as well. If someone who's a troll, and it's not a real person, let's not get it twisted now. It isn't a proper account. It's a troll that came in my live with no following, right, that was go goading me and goading my comments and saying horrendous things in the comment. So I told them to go and jump off a bridge, and I'll say it again and again. These aren't people that deserve respect. These are people that hiding behind accounts, destroying people shaming them saying disgusting comments so my respect there is gone i'm sorry i don't give a shit about trolls and i don't give a shit about their comments i'll say how it is but yeah oh they're still a person grow up lauren grow up they're not real people are they if you can't literally take stand stand on business and come on a real account and say how you feel i'm sorry if you come in and start disrupting my room saying disgusting things to people in my comments and that i don't have no respect i'm sorry i don't that's yeah. how it is. But, you know, I'm going to jump down. But anyway, I'll be live in a bit anyway, so. Oh, thank you, Alex. No. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. Thank you, everybody. Um, right, guys. So, and also remember, you know, um, how many times has Evil Queen told people to go and get ropes? Same people digging at Alex. So the same people that support people that say that. You know? Right, God, exactly. This is what I'm saying. It's all right for other people to say and do whatever they want. As soon as it's anyone over this side, we're all wrong guns. We're all bad guys. I don't give a fuck anymore, you know. Um, none of it's right. I'm not saying it's right. But, you know, it was a troll. And like I say, people want to tell people to, um, you know, sw swing and things like that. Selective outrage, isn't it? Selective outrage. It always will be selective outrage. Yes. Uh, <clears throat> not around here, though. Yeah. And we'll keep it real around here. Uh, we might be the clip, but they are the mean girls. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, and I will stand my ground. They can all piss off. Don't care. Uh, I love you, too. As usual, it's the clips for everything. It doesn't matter now. It, today will be a whole conversation about me and this live and Alex. You watch, I know how it goes, but what can you do? I ain't going anywhere, neither is anybody else, so uh, stay affected. But thank you, everybody, for joining the boxes. And uh, like I say, anyone that found the conversations difficult, um, I do apologise, but you can take yourself out of the room. Uh, I, was st I am still going, D.A., I could stay on a bit longer and still go. Yeah, I might do that, actually. I was going to go, guys, but now, because DA said you're still going on, I'm going to stay longer. Alexa, play, play baby bye-bye. I missed something. Can you say it again? Alexa, play bye-bye baby. Here's bye-bye baby by Bay City Rollers.